creating the perfect storm in the name of innovation. Automotive Center of Excellence at the University of Ontario Institute of Technology. Creating severe weather is no longer exclusively in the hands of Mother Nature. At the University of Ontario Institute of Technology in Oshawa, it's now possible to create an Arctic blizzard, scorching desert heat or driving rain at the flip of a switch. This unique weather machine is located inside the Automotive Center of Excellence, or ACE for short. ACE is the first testing and research center of its kind in Canada, and in many respects the world. The signature test chamber in ACE is a climatic wind tunnel, large enough to accommodate a full coach bus. In this chamber, wind speeds can exceed 240 kilometers an hour. Temperatures can range from minus 40 to plus 60 degrees Celsius. Relative humidity ranges from 5 to 95 percent. There is an easily reconfigurable solar array that will replicate the effects of the sun. And the chamber is hydrogen capable, allowing for advanced fuel cell development. The wind tunnel also has a variable nozzle, allowing for a range of vehicle and test property sizes. Coupled with this is a dynamometer, or road simulator, located within a large turntable. So for the first time anywhere, ACE can accommodate crosswind development. There are other test chambers as well. ACE has a large and a small climate chamber that provide exacting conditions of both temperature and humidity. ACE has a drive-on four-poster shaker within a climatic chamber. This vertical axis shaker can replicate a variety of road surfaces, like cobblestone or gravel roads. ACE also has a multi-axis shaker table, or MAST, located in a hemi-anechoic chamber. The six-axis inverted hexapod design allows for products to be tested for structural durability and the detection of noise and vibration in three dimensions. Although the facility is called the Automotive Center of Excellence, the applications are far broader than just automotive. Just ask Dan Riskin, the host of Discovery Channel's flagship news program, Daily Planet. He endured winds in excess of 175 kilometers an hour to demonstrate the effects of hurricane force winds. ACE was also used by a television production crew from the United Kingdom for a 3D documentary on extreme weather. National Geographic Channel producer Martin Martimore says ACE was an ideal location to recreate images of the 1998 Eastern Ontario ice storm. National Geographic used ACE's climatic wind tunnel to demonstrate the devastating impact of ice buildup on hydro lines, as well as ACE's multi-axis shaker table to recreate the effects of the 2011 earthquake in Japan. But small dramatic scenes could be enacted here very easily. Uh, in, as I say, either in wind, heat, cold, ice, snow. People being trapped in the snow, for example, is not difficult to do if you've got snow on tap. Uh, if you're making a film about snow and you happen to be in the summer, be able to walk in here and turn on the snowstorm is amazing. Ace also caught the attention of CBC television comedian Rick Mercer. While the weather was mild outside the facility, on the inside there was a full raging blizzard in the climatic wind tunnel. Intrigued by the possibilities, Rick decided to shoot a segment for an episode of the nationally broadcast Rick Mercer Report. Due to the size of the chambers, ACE can accommodate trucks, tandem drive systems, full coach buses, light rail transit, aerospace, military and agricultural applications, wind turbines and solar panels. ACE could also be used to train military personnel, rescue crews or competitive athletes to carry out performance testing of outdoor survival gear. It has the potential to assist the movie industry or test anything that is subject to severe wind humidity, snow, icing, or desert heat. ACE is where the next generation of electric vehicles, green energy technology, and products we haven't even thought of yet will be developed. At ACE, we are creating the perfect storm in the name of innovation. To book testing time at ACE or to take a tour, please visit www.ace.uoit.ca.